Millions of dollars in Triumph Gulf Coast funding coming to the University of West Florida. It's to fund the Watercraft and Vessel Engineering or WAVE project. The university says this project will connect engineering and technology students to watercraft industries across Northwest Florida. WEAR's Karis Harmon joining us now in the studio. And Karis, UWF students be able to get some hands-on experience with this place. Yeah, and not just that, they'll also get the opportunity to work directly with sailing team American Magic. We imagine getting underway in about six to eight months where our students, our scientists, and other entrepreneurs in the area will start working on high-tech foiling opportunity to improve boat design in the region. That's Nicole Gislesson. She's the executive director for the University of West Florida's Haas Center. She says the funding approved by Triumph Gulf Coast will create an amazing opportunity for the university and its students, telling me the money will allow for expansion of research, specifically around maritime activities at the Port of Pensacola. And it's an expansion of C3D, Science, Engineering and Art, which is in downtown Pensacola in the Museum of Commerce, where we've been prototyping for almost eight years now. And so this will allow our group, as well as mechanical engineering, to work directly with American Magic. Students getting hands-on experience at the port, while also working with a world-renowned racing team that calls Pensacola home. Truly unique opportunity, and we hope that we will be able to recruit students from all over the nation in, to work alongside our students and, and scientists in the watercraft and vessel engineering program. She also says the project will add some high paying research jobs to the university. We hope to expand uh, the entrepreneurial activity around maritime racing as well as um, boat building. Um, some of our students will have the opportunity to work alongside both the professionals and the scientists. And we envision an opportunity where the students can also earn composite certifications, and so that's really exciting too. Her hope for the future, the WAVE project attracting companies to relocate in and around Pensacola. I hope that engineering groups will also take advantage of this opportunity. And, you know, I am also hopeful that some of our students will be among those who start businesses right here in Pensacola. The university already has a space at the port for students to work, but this will allow them to do much more. Kislesson tells me she's grateful to Triumph as well as other community partners. In the studio, Karis Harmon, WEAR News.